When I think of Bret Hart, I think of the excellence of execution. Hey guys, it's Ash here with Watch Mojo, and these are the top 10 greatest moments of respect in WWE. For this list, we'll be ranking the instances where WWE performers or characters showed some measure of respect or emotional connection within their storyline or against their opponents. Did we leave any out? Let us know in those comments below. Number 10. A Couple Reunited Respect takes many different forms. Here, it's more of a storyline-based feeling handed out to the audience. A respect to the characters telling the story regardless of what was going on behind the scenes. This is due to the real-life marriage between Macho Man Randy Savage and Miss Elizabeth falling apart, even as their on-screen counterparts were reunited. The amount of actual feel-good moments in the E weren't exactly as prevalent back in the WWF days, so to see Miss Elizabeth leap from the WrestleMania 7 crowd to reclaim her man after Savage lost a retirement match brought tears to the eyes of many fans. The pair even scored the only kayfabe wedding not to be interrupted by some sort of shenanigans, which is no mean feat. Number 9. The Rock and Steve Austin Rivalry the professional rivalry between The Rock and Stone Cold Steve Austin was a fine bit of modern wrestling storytelling. Two absolute masters battling for top draw on the card. Austin had defeated The Rock at both of their prior WrestleMania encounters until their final match at WrestleMania 19. This night belonged to The Rock, however, who defeated Stone Cold after three rock bottoms. It's post-match where things get interesting, as The Rock shoves referee Earl Hebner out the way in order to speak to Austin on the canvas. Rocky's body language appears almost protective of Austin, which was out of character behavior for The Rock's heel persona. Stone Cold would retire shortly after this match, and this brief exchange between the two clearly feels like a passing of the torch. Number 8. Real Recognizes Real The Undertaker was the most ardent protector of kayfabe to ever lace up a pair of boots. The man born Mark Calloway was determined to keep the mystique of pro wrestling alive treating his character with the utmost respect. There were exceptions, however, such as Ric Flair's retirement ceremony on Monday Night Raw. The dead man showed up alongside the entire locker room to pay their respects to the Nature Boy. Flair had just retired for the first time and The Undertaker made a grand entrance to the ring. Taker's on-screen canonical show of respect by taking a knee might have been enough, but his embracing of Flair after the show went off the air made the whole night feel all the more special. Number 7. Passing the Torch WWE fans of a certain age will likely remember the days where Hulkamania ran wild upon basically every opponent in its path. Hogan, quite frankly, never lost clean, usually only grabbing an L via disqualification or outside interference. This night was different, however. It was the beginning of the Ultimate Warrior experiment, where Hogan was booked to do the job for Warrior at WrestleMania 6. Hogan was pinned, though he basically kicked out at 3.25 seconds, and the crowd was stunned. Would Hogan crown his successor? Well, yeah, actually. It was slow at first, but the sight of Hogan raising Warrior's hand in victory was a huge, some might say heartbreaking deal for an entire generation of Hulkamaniacs. Number 6. Hart and Michaels Bury the Hatchet it's the most discussed and analyzed moment in wrestling history, the Montreal Screwjob. But would two of its most high-profile participants, Shawn Michaels and Bret the Hitman Hart, ever bury the hatchet? It took a while, over a decade in fact, but the pair did finally put the past behind them on an episode of Monday Night Raw. I think I'd like to take this opportunity right now to bury the hatchet with you. The January 4th episode of the show brought the men together for a segment that many thought might never occur. The amount of water underneath this professional bridge may have seemed insurmountable, but the sight of Michaels and Hart finally coming to terms with their past was a heartwarming sight to behold. Yeah! 
Number 5. United in Pain The outcomes of professional wrestling may be predetermined, but there's no denying the blood, sweat, and tears that go into creating true magic within the squared circle. Triple H and The Undertaker did just that at WrestleMania 28, alongside Shawn Michaels as a special guest referee. The stories told by the physical actions of the three men are amazing, but the final third is where things truly ramp up to a no-perfect finale. The sight of opponents leaving the ring arm in arm is rarer than hen's teeth, but it somehow made sense for the bloodied and broken pair with Michaels to make their way back up the ramp. The crowd responded in kind, recognizing all three for the work they had just put in, leaving it all in the ring. Number 4. Stay Down There's a reason why The Undertaker has appeared multiple times throughout this list. He was just a master storyteller. Shawn Michaels was too. So, when the pair met at WrestleMania 26, with the Heartbreak Kid's career on the line, the audience knew they were in for some magic. The pair didn't disappoint, putting on a clinic of physicality and storyline beats. From Michaels' thumb across the throat request for Undertaker to end it, to the latter's request for Shawn Michaels to stay down, it's all goosebumps. Then, after the dust settled, The Undertaker emerged victorious. The pair shook hands and embraced, two absolute legends pulling out all the stops. Number 3. A Guerrero Tribute Typically, not all professional wrestling tributes get to occur when the subject is living. This was the case with Eddie Guerrero, who was taken from his family and fans all too soon back in 2005. Eddie was in the prime of his life, 38 years old, in the prime of his career. The November 14th episode of Raw served as a tribute to Guerrero, and it is heartbreaking stuff. The outpouring of love and respect for Eddie was palpable from ring to rafters, as both superstars and fans joined together in celebrating Guerrero's life and career. Many on camera are visibly shaken and overcome with grief, despite all attempts to make this episode of Raw shine a light through some very real darkness. Number 2. Hulk Still Rules Nostalgia can be a powerful drug, so powerful that it can even alter the storyline of a professional wrestling match. The Toronto Skydome was on fire during WrestleMania 18, particularly during the match between Hollywood Hulk Hogan and The Rock. The crowd just refused to boo Hogan, despite his heel status in the match, leading to the kind of magic that can only occur during these sort of unscripted wrestling moments. The outpouring of respect for Hogan's legacy is palpable, as Toronto hurrahs every big boot and leg drop as if it was 1987. The Hulkster may not have come out on top, but the respect shown to him by both the Toronto crowd and The Rock will forever live in wrestling history. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure to go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. I'm Sorry, I Love You They were the words that proved this stuff was still real to us, damn it. The sort of pro wrestling magic that could have only come from the mind of Shawn Michaels during this retirement match for Ric Flair. The image of Flair putting up his fists in a futile attempt to fight off the inevitable is heartbreaking, while Michaels mouthing the immortal words, I'm sorry, I love you, before putting away Flair with a super kick is the stuff of legend. Jim Ross's play-by-play -play echoes the importance of what we're seeing, while Sean's immediate embrace of Flair after the referee counts the three underlines in perfect fashion the emotional power this sport can possess when placed in the right hands. Did you enjoy this video? Check out these other clips from Watch Mojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.